hi everyone welcome to my channel my name is jenny and you are in turkey headquarter happy new month to you my beautiful people and i'm wishing you all a blessed june so today's video um, is about olori ashley or you can call her olori afolashade um she is one of only of his wife um sometime um early this year it was rumored that she was pregnant um if you see if you're seeing this video right here by my left side you will notice that um she had a little big um stomach that a lot of people think that she's pregnant we are not really sure whether she was pregnant or not but you know later you know she disappeared um on social media you know because of how people were trolling her consigning queen naomi's um post she made um in december saying that she has she's no more the queen of filet and all of that so a lot of people accused her and you know she deactivated her account and later came back so right now um she came back again with this beautiful picture you are seeing on my right side and according to what i heard i'm not sure i've seen a couple of videos where people are saying that um that she lost the pregnancy them saying that she lost the pregnancy is not really my problem um, my problem is the way they are putting it see even if um she was not pregnant or she was pregnant for a woman to live um to lose her baby is traumatic so i wonder how the way people are putting it are they like happy that she lost the pregnancy or are they mocking her man before anything we all are humans we should know how to talk to people a woman that loses her pregnancy um is always traumatized i've been in that shoe before but i don't i wonder how um how i don't know how humanity is going down people don't really think about how another person is feeling it's just only about you 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 if someone loses pregnancy does not warrant you to badmouth the person nobody is a saint no matter what olori actually has not done anything to none of us she has not even done anything to queen naomi she's not even having any problem with queen naomi even if you love queen naomi a lot it doesn't warrant you to mock um somebody that loses her baby indirectly you're mocking the person in that if even directly it's not nice you know people are saying that she looks so slim here that where is the baby oh that she has miscarriage and all of that let's assume she had it would that make you happy that another woman loses her baby no i'm highly disappointed on some videos that i watch on this space because of this particular woman i'm highly highly disappointed i'm highly highly disappointed it's not supposed to be so no matter your favorite no matter who you love always always stand on the truth no matter what she lost her pregnancy you you fix your camera to, um your to make a video and you're mocking her you're mocking her you god even if um you have all the whole children in the whole world must you mock her you can make your video and state your fact that oh you heard that blah 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 this person she lost her baby and all of that you console console her it's not easy she has a daughter and that her daughter is maybe like eight years or nine years right now and she has not had another baby since then don't you think she's been trying to conceive let's assume um she let her you know got pregnant and she loses the baby you just come out on social media and be saying all those stuff you are saying that is not nice that is not good it's not good we should learn how to talk that you did not lose your baby or you did not lose your pregnancy or maybe you have a favorite person that you love or person you feel that maybe the person is the cause of um, the person's problem whereas you are not even sure whereas you are not even living inside the palace you just came out and you know indirectly mock your fellow woman for you know losing her baby no that is not nice honestly
Ashley has not offended any of us. Forget about we are doing YouTube. We are doing YouTube. We are um, telling people what is happening, correct current happenings, updating people um, about the king, the queen, what is happening. We are not, we are not, you are not in enmity with them. Your duty is just to say your, um, do your news, say your opinion, don't take side. Don't mock another person or this and that. No, it's not nice. I think people are taking this, doing this video of a thing. They are taking it way, way too far. This is a woman. Let's assume you know someone that lost her baby. Maybe because you don't like the person, you'll be happy that the person lost her baby. No. It's not, it's not, I don't know how um, another person was brought up, but I was not brought up like that. Like, I can't, even if my, if, even if I see my enemy, you know, hurting, it will still, I'll still feel so bad about the person i'll feel like consoling the person if the person will allow me talk more of someone that you don't even know talk more of another woman losing her baby and all you could do is just said blah 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 no that is not nice humanity first though before every other thing and the funny thing is even if you like fight fight for queen naomi just because you said you love her queen naomi will not even dash you a dime just because you love Queen Naomi will not warrant you to mock another woman for losing her baby. Even Queen Naomi herself will be highly disappointed at you. Even Queen Naomi herself, if, if at all this woman loses her baby, I know that Queen Naomi will surely call her to console her. But right here, a lot of people are on YouTube, you know, doing anyhow. You call yourself a blogger or a YouTuber and you lost your sense of reasoning just because you are a youtuber just because you love someone no it's not like that life is not like that there is life after youtube what if um youtube woke up this morning and said oh i'm closing this platform and in future you happen to run run um to this person right here or to the people that you talk down on how will you feel and maybe they are the only people that will help you nobody knows tomorrow this world is just like a circle it goes round the place it went before it will sweet turn down if you are going up eh if you are going upstairs you are going to first floor you will still you pass from the down to the up and then if you are coming down you still pass from that down so those people you meet on your way up on your way down you still meet them so this is just a proverb if you don't get it forget about it please let's be guided god please console this lady if at all um she lost a pregnancy or she's going through anything god please console her and strengthen her and give her another baby if you're watching this video and you are passing through something and you are passing through anything that um like so traumatic or you lost your baby or you lost your pregnancy um i'm so sorry don't worry god will, god will wipe away your tears no matter what you are going through right now just stay strong nothing stays permanent it's just for a while and as long as you are alive you will keep people will keep encountering different problems whether big small so just keep your head up and never give up okay i'm wishing you all a beautiful new month of june may god answer all your secret prayers in jesus name amen thank you so much for watching and if you watch up to this moment and you have not subscribed to my channel please subscribe and click on that notification bell so you'll be getting notification each time i post a new video thank you and god bless you